Good morning. This morning you join me down at Weymouth Lifeboat Station where there's the launch of a new book, Weymouth Lifeboats, an illustrated history of 150 years of lifeboats. I just switch the camera around and we'll get more details. Okay, so you just introduce yourselves. Uh, and, sorry, and, uh, Andy Sargent on the coxswain of uh, Weymouth Lifeboat Station. And I'm Nicholas Lynch, the author of the Lifeboat book. Right, and we're here today for a life book, uh, a lifeboat book launch that you've written, Nick. That's right, yeah, I've written this book to mark 150 years of lifeboats at Weymouth. Um, the project started a few years ago thanks to Andy who contacted me and wanted to mark the um, anniversary of the station's founding this year. So for the last two or three years we've been putting together stories, rescues, details of the lifeboats to uh, put together in the volume which has been launched today, it's just been published. Right and um how, how long does the, the book stretch? You know, how far back in history does well, it, it go? It starts when the station was founded 150 years ago and it comes right up to date. So uh, it covers all, all the latest, the new lifeboat or the lifeboat that's been here, that, you know, the current lifeboat. And it covers all of the rescues between when it was opened and, and today. And there have been some very famous medal winning rescues undertaken by the Weymouth lifeboat can crews. You, can you remember any? Um, there are have a look at the, the book. medal winning book. The best thing to do is to have a look through, sure. the, through, through the book. Um, what were the medal winning rescues? Uh, the last medal was in 87, which was awarded to a copter mechanic I remember um, for a bronze medal for uh, a rescue in the hurricane that came through. And the one before that was in uh, 75, which was to the uh, Cox and Vicks Pitman. Um, which was a silver medal to the yacht Latifa, which was in a hurricane. And that is a very well known rescue, isn't it? It is. Yes. It's, it's a very famous rescue. Yeah. So that noise you can hear in the background is the pages going off. So is that a, is that a shout? Um, so the boats are launching, I don't know which boat it is. But, uh, yeah. So there you go, a, a live. So the ALB is being launched. Is it? Yeah. Right. I really need to go and take some photographs. Oh, oh, there we are. Okay. So, so how long is it? How long is it taken to? You, how long is it taking you to write the book? We've been working on it for about <laughs> three years, I reckon. Yeah. On and yeah. off. Um, but we were programming it to be published this year to coincide with the anniversary. Right. So. Um, I've done a lot of research down in the Iron Lines headquarters in Poole. They've supplied a lot of information locally, a lot of photographs of old lifeboats, old lifeboat crews. And we've managed to put it all together. So it's a little bit from the Iron Lines headquarters and a little bit from Weymouth. Right. So, um, yeah, the book's available today to about midday. Yeah, right. and, uh, Nicholas. and then it'll be available after that in the Weymouth <coughs> Lifeboat Shop, okay. which is open every day. Yeah, from half ten till four. Okay. So... Have you got a website or have you got websites? Yeah, so the station website is uh, Weymouth Lifeboats. Um, uh, if you just put in a Google search for Weymouth Lifeboat, it'll come up with a website. It's also on Facebook page and Instagram. And okay. it's published by Fox Club Publishing and they have their own Facebook page as well. Right. So you, you just look that up. Fo well, just do a search on on in Facebook for Fox Love Publishing. Fox. Fox. Okay. 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 Great. Okay. All right. Thanks so much. What do you think? Have a look at the uh, book. Come down to the lifeboat station and buy the book. All right. Bye for now.